Hey guys, Eto here, and welcome to a brand new video on some unlockable kits which are available on FIFA 16 Ultimate Team. And in this video right here, particularly, we are going to be talking about the brand new Legends unlockable kit, which you guys can win from winning this tournament right here, the EA Access Cup. Now, sadly, this tournament is only available on the Xbox One console uh, because it is to celebrate FIFA 16 being put into the EA Access Vault. Now, that isn't on PlayStation, so you can't get it on PS4 or PS3, and it is an Xbox One exclusive, which means you're not going to be able to get it on Xbox 360 either. Now, that isn't EA's fault. That is actually Sony's fault that they haven't got the Legends. Uh, so, yeah, if you are on uh, PlayStation, that is why you cannot play this tournament. But, uh, yeah, I have previously won it. Uh, and I will show you guys a clip in a minute of me uh, actually guessing the kit and uh, unlocking it. I will show you guys what it looks like as well. But uh, yeah, the first prize you do get is to win a Lone Legend pack. And you also win the uh, unlockable Legends kit. Now, the kit is untradeable. It was tradable slightly earlier on today. So you could have potentially picked it up on the transfer market. Now, another kit was actually listed on the transfer market. And that was another Legends kit. In total, there are three Legends kits. There's the home one, the away one, and the third kit. And uh, there is also two other, no, actually three other unlockable kits. There is the uh, black uh, Division 1 kit. There's a white kit, which I think is from winning the offline seasons, but I'm not too sure. Uh, I've not actually seen that yet. And there is also the kit for winning the seven years of foot tournament. That is the yellow and black kit. But so, yeah, this one is very, very easy to unlock because the tournament is on semi-pro. Now, you should very easily beat that. Is the one above amateur. I was putting five goals past pretty much all of my opponents other than in the final. And uh, yeah, you come up against pretty good teams. I came up against uh, Man City, Galacast, right, Inter Milan and Arsenal. But I managed to win all of them very comfortably. You should very easily win at the tournament. And yeah, you get a Lone Legend pack and the kit. The second prize you get the, uh, for the second time of winning it is 2,000 coins, as you can see on screen right now. And apparently, uh, the third prize, because this uh, tournament I think is out for seven days in all. It has currently got five days left. They're not really going to do just two prizes for a seven day tournament so we could see a lot of better prizes later on in the tournament from what i have heard there is maybe another kit to be won uh, maybe with the third uh the third win or the fourth win because another kit was seen on the market earlier on today and that was another legends kit but uh, anyway it is a very easy tournament to win the only uh, entry requirement is a three and a half star team now i will just quickly show you guys the team i am using but you can just bronze bench and use any team really that you do want this is the team though, you can use your bronze stars pack team, but I just used a load of untradeable players, so I didn't really spend any money on the team. All these players right here, as you can see, are first owner untradeable players. Just use a bronze bench to bring the rating down, and uh, yeah, you can use pretty much any team you want. It is on semi-pro, so you should very, very easily win this tournament. So without further ado, let's move on to see what the kit actually looks like, and I'll show you guys a clip of me actually unlocking the kit. So as you guys can see right now, we've just managed to unlock the kit. I won the tournament. It was quite easy. I think we did beat Arsenal in the final. And yeah, this is the kit. We've unlocked the white uh, Legends kit. We've also unlocked a lone Legend pack, so I'm going to advance. And uh, yeah, as you can see right here, we did manage to beat Arsenal 3-2 in the end. I did stop playing though uh, after I did go 3-0 up quite early on in the game. So yeah, let's see the kit that we did unlock. Uh, I think it should just come into the club right now. Yes, here it does come up. So it is actually untradeable. It was tradable uh, earlier on today, actually, uh, the work cards of this coming up on the market. But I'm going to make this active instead of my river plate kit right here. And it looks quite cool. Yeah, it's got kind of the black V16 badge right here, which does look pretty cool. So I'm going to go to the... Uh, actually, I'll just quickly open this pack first here. Then we can see what the kit is like. So the Lone Legend pack has got three rare players in, so I'm not sure if that's three legends or if it's two bronzes or what, but let's see what we do get. Who's that going to be? That is Van Basten. No, I thought that was Van Basten. It's Van Nistelrooy, who I will take. We also get a pretty decent silver right there as well. So I'll send um, him to the club, and then I will send that guy to the transfer list, and I will uh, quick sell the rest. So he can... Oh, wait. Wait, they're all untradeable, actually. So I will... Uh, just send all those to the club doesn't really matter never going to be using those but i might need them for a tournament or something maybe on the bench so guys as you can see right here this is what the kit looks like it is white it has got black stripes uh, down the middle vertical black stripes it has got yellow collar yellow rings around the arms and it has got the few 16 ultimate team black badge on it as well it does say e access on it which is quite cool and overall it's a pretty good kit i do personally prefer the black kit 
which is the Division 1 kit, but this kit still does look very, very nice. Now, this other kit right here is the one that I was talking about earlier on, and I think you unlock this by winning the offline seasons, but I'm not too sure yet. I haven't seen anyone with the kit, but I have heard some people say uh, that they have managed to get it by winning the uh, offline seasons. But, uh, yeah, overall, this kit does look pretty cool, and uh, I'm pretty pleased to have unlocked it. It was very, very easy to unlock, so for you guys who uh, maybe couldn't win the uh, tournament, uh, the seven years of foot tournament which did have an unlockable kit or you can't win division one this is a very very easy unlockable kit you guys can win to uh, show off and uh, use in your ultimate team but uh, yeah go and try the tournament out it's out for another five days it's on semi pro so you should very very easily win it but uh, yeah anyway hopefully you guys did enjoy the video if you did smash the like subscribe new and i'll see you in my next video take care